right then, this is Sharky from Sharky. So today we're going to show off one of our brand new designs, which is the Deadstone Pirates Shark Shooter. Now this unit comes with a Ryzen 5 CPU, 16 gig of DDR4 RAM, an RTX 4060 graphics card, which is now standard with these builds, what supports up to 4K on large screen 4K TVs. It also has a one terabyte M.2 SSD. There's still plenty of room for a lot of new games that are coming out as well to be added on the system. Now you can order add-ons for this build. Um, you can order a one terabyte SSD backup drive. What that consists of is a backup drive which if Ever the system ever needs to be restored you can restore straight from that drive back to its original health also with the backup drive you can send that back to us and um, when we've got an update for you and then we can clone that free of charge send it back to you um, with all the brand new titles on as long as you pay the shipping back to you that's absolutely fine we'll do that send it back to you you'll have all the updated titles on there as well um, also, you can purchase Chris Cool Mod's um, Light Gun Beast Drive. Now, his Beast Light Gun Drive consists of an extra 750, I believe, new shooting games. Um, the support for those games and those games are supported with the Gun for IR, the Wii Controller Kit, the um, M Track Light Gun and the blamcom and retro shooters now he has plenty of videos up on his channel so if you wish to check that out i'll leave a link in the description so check his website out check his channel out he does some amazing stuff he's an absolute wizard with these front ends and getting the massive collections of games it's ridiculous so basically what that does with the unit as well it turns it into an all-in-one arcade shooter now these are real guns that's on this system so the work of analog controls so not every shooter is supported only the shooting games that come basic with the system now with chris cool mods drive you can then plug in gun for ir guns which are more for mouse games and stuff mouse shooters so then those gun for ir guns or aim track guns will work on the shark shooter alongside the shark shooter allowing those extra games to be played now some gun kits can be quite expensive i know the gun for ir aren't cheap but the best you can get are the original creators of gun for ir which you can get them from gunforir.com or rpegelectronics.com anyone else selling them as far as i'm aware aren't official sellers of the guns now you can get them from um china and places like that a lot lot cheaper but they're not to the quality of the guns that you get from rpeg electronics and gun for ir now then what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut away i'm going to show off the a couple of little features on this and go through the artwork with you catch us in a second Right, so I hope the camera does pick it up because the colours on this unit is outstanding. Um, a lot of my customers will tell you the units look a hell of a lot different compared to the camera footage or the photographs to the actual scene, the unit. The high quality images um, are just superb on these builds. Now, I do have a Reddit page down below where I do share all my high quality images I do take of the builds. Now some images we do have trouble taking pictures of because um, certain acrylics and glares and stuff like that can slightly alter the colour of taking a picture. Same with the lighting in here, the lighting in this room isn't perfect. So let's go through this artwork, I'm buzzing with this design. It looks absolutely stunning from top to bottom. Now across the guns we have, like we've done on the House of the Dead before, is these gold rails on the guns. And then because the game was done 
by Namco, we have those nice Namco um, badges on the back of the guns there on gold acrylic. Now coming across the top of the control panel, we have this Goonie-esque design. Um, it's similar to my Goonies design with that nice um, background there with all the pirate features in the background. That's actually a skull rock and stuff um, and the two main characters of dead stone pirates there now dead stone pirates itself is hard to get any decent quality images i've spent hours upon hours enhancing these images to the highest possible quality to bring the best build quality out there now if you look at the dead stone pirates logo as well that has been super enhanced as well because it's such it's not a most popular game and um, there's not a lot of images online of dead stone pirates itself so it's really hard to get high quality images so that custom grill there looks absolutely stunning now we have these face plates with dead stone pirates now there is if you get in close, it is a faded pirate ship and the actual original arcade design in the background faded in there. In certain angles and certain lights, you can actually see it, but the camera I don't think is gonna pick it up. So we have player one and player two there with that nice Dead Storm Pirates logo. Now on the top of these rails, there is a wood effect I've printed as well. This is actually custom acrylic that I print. Um, and the wood effect has come out absolutely stunning. Um, I put it actually on black acrylic because I thought the white would stand out a bit too much on there. So nice black acrylic and you've got that nice dark wood effect, burnt wood effect there on the top, really setting the theme for this cabinet. Now, if we come across the center art there, we have that same dark wood effect going around the unit. Really just looks absolutely stunning on this build. And um, we have that amu amusement to entertainment Namco logo there as well. And we've just went with some red um, control buttons coming around. Now these are official Samo buttons as well. And then throughout the whole unit, we do have that gold trim going right the way around really setting the theme for this build really stands out and if we come around the front the front's just it way the back sorry the back's just as pretty as the front we come along there we've got that nice mirror gold acrylic there as well for that power plate and then the back plate here we do have our um rtx 40 60 graphics card we have three ports as well and there's a ton of usb ports on the side there as well network connectors stuff like that and you do have wi-fi antennas with this build so you get your wi-fi antennas and the wi-fi is pretty good on these builds and um, they've got great connectivity with these units that are a small form factor mini itx motherboard but they're a decent motherboard that's why you pay the little extra for the extra quality um, I only buy brand new parts, I don't buy second hand parts and I hand pick all the parts for these builds. You get a high end motherboard, CPU, RAM. Now just quickly go to those face plates on the side as well. There's so much detail with the pirate ship in the back there, the Deadstone Pirates logo there and this rock formation coming around with the skulls at the bottom and stuff. Just so much detail in the actual design itself when you get up close and personal to the actual build and standing back looking at it it's just a stunning piece of kit and um, it's going to look great in the customer's place now this custom actually has two of my builds they have the deadstone pirates and they have the jurassic park build that's up on the left hand side now a unit like this is going to cost you around 2500 um, we do um offer a pedestal with these builds now if you're in the us or in europe it is going to get a little costly and um, sending the pedestal as well now there is other pedestal options you can if you're in the us if you hit um rec rooms them can build pedestals for you they have done for my control panels in the past now if you wanted to ask them to um cnc my stuff i'm happy to send the actual pedestal design 
off to someone like Rec Rooms and um, Game Room Solutions, is it? I can't remember the name of them. Um, basically, I'm happy to send the actual um, CNC cut files if they want to cut it for you. Um, it'll work out a lot cheaper than getting it from me. Obviously, the quality of wood won't be the same. I use high quality melamine resistant MDF on all my bills. It is quite costly even for small sheets of that stuff. But I've had this stuff before left in damp room, stuff like that. I've had um, water damage in my new shop which one of these units was actually sat in a puddle of water and there's zero moisture in the wood or anything like that. And you know MDF, anyone that's worked with MDF, it swells instantly, it draws the water in and it splits. With this stuff, it doesn't do that. It is moisture resistant. It's not meant to be waterproof, but uh, like I say, I've got units that I can go ahead and do another video of that and really show it off. I've got videos of it actually sat in a puddle of water overnight and it's absolutely fine. Um, so yeah, like I said, the wood is super high quality. It is highly durable as well. Um, like I say, these units start from 2,500. Shipping to the US, I think is around 340, 350 pound. And then the cost of the shipping crate, you're gonna pay about 100 quid for the shipping crate. So um, you're looking at about three grand in for shipping and everything for these units. Now, like I said, it does sound costly, but it's high-end parts. You are paying quite a bit for the actual parts themselves. Inside, there's power supply, stuff like that. So these run off 24 volt power supply. So let's check out Dead Storm Pirates. Now with the system, you do get simulated recoil and true recoil. So simulated recoil is, um, you can set it a single shot or rapid fire and tell the system that that's a single shot game or rapid fire game. True recoil is if you um, change your gun, um, it can change from single rapid single fire to rapid fire and so on, depending on what gun you're holding within the game. Now this system is currently being updated with a ton of new setups and settings. Um, we may also change the operating system at some point soon as well. So it is recommended you do have a backup drive just in case you want to send your drive back. It means the system's still in commission while you're getting your backup drive restored. Okay, so let's skip this, press start. Now with Dead Stone Pirates, you've got a left and right pinball for your wheel. So I just hold the right pinball on this screen here and that turns the wheel for us.
Swear I won't forget this Why do I regret this? In my mind reckless Thoughts are feeling endless Sitting up I'm breathless Anxiety's infectious I feel so defenseless Betrayed and embarrassed I hate being open I hate being broken I feel like an ocean Filled up with emotion Anger ain't a potion Rub it on like lotion I can feel it soaking Reopen the scars have awoken I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost, never at home Need to be strong, every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost, never at home Need to be strong, every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go